Hi guys, so it's been almost three days since we made our sour cream preparation. So on Friday I showed you in the first video how to make your coconut yogurt, then ferment it for 12 hours outside, so on the kitchen counter or in the oven with the oven light on. And then you keep it ideally for 48 hours. So we kept ours just 48 hours so it's like that one day of fermentation and then we keep it sitting closed with the lid in the refrigerator so here i have my perfectly fermented ready to eat um, coconut yogurt and i'm going to take this uh, less than one cup and today i'm using just a very simple tiny it's not even a blender it's more like a food processor and i'm doing this because uh, more and more people say oh for the raw vegan kitchen you actually need special equipment no you don't need special equipment and therefore i'm going to demonstrate you that with the cheapest um, equipment you can already do a lot of really nice things so don't worry about buying expensive equipment i know from experience some people just don't have that money to invest in expensive stuff. So I show you how to use very easy, cheap equipment to make exactly the same delicious foods. So we added here um, a little bit less than one cup of uh, coconut yogurt and then we're gonna add about half a teaspoon of salt. So I'm won't label the salt now because actually you should decide by yourself what sort of salt you use. So my favorites are sea salt, Himalaya pink salt, um, Celtic salt and right now my top favorite is uh, kelp salt. And here I have an extra special uh, lemon salt that my mom brought back from Europe. Okay, and then we have here a uh, quarter cup of apple cider vinegar and if you don't like apple cider vinegar please do go for yogurt uh, for lemon yeah so you have to decide for yourself now I'm using this just because it's tiny and it's gonna blend in very well okay. I bought this one at the France France store in uh, Aoyama so it was super cheap and I just thought why not to try so I did use a little bit less um, vinegar because actually my husband tasted the sour cream and he liked its taste but he didn't like the consistency so I decided to go for only a quarter cup of vinegar and I'm going to transfer everything now in a glass container and I will give it until tonight another maybe five six hours and it will thicken a little bit but whatever you do this is your raw vegan classic sour cream nothing fancy here very basic ingredients and super 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 tasty okay there we go that is the end product um, please subscribe to my channel and let me know what you would like to do and i see you very very soon thank you